my lips kind of look like I just kissed Smurfette. Hey everyone, welcome to See Your Star, uplifting your power and taking you higher, lower, around, and having fun. Of course, uplifting your success, wealth, abundance, everything that you're wanting in your life to the next level. So, I'm here to talk to you about today about standing out being different, as you can probably tell by the blue, blue on my lips, which actually isn't even that different these days. Now you can, you know, at least you used to be able to buy them sometimes even Sephora. I don't know if you can right now or not, but yeah, it just wasn't always the case. So my point, see, being different. Again, my channel is all about you know, celebrating your uniqueness and being able to use actual real life tools that will catapult your business, your physical health, your mental and emotional well-being, spiritual, all that good stuff. So let's just get into it. All right, put the star down. Put the star down. No one will get hurt. So yeah, standing out and being different. So this is something I definitely could be an expert on, standing out and being different. I'm very good at it. I have, I'm sure there are many people who are subscribers. Thank you so much again for joining me. That uh, probably feel the same way. And there, maybe there's some who out there who want to be different, but are afraid to do that. There's a message for all of you in this. Being different, so I'll talk about it physically, but really it's kind of more a state of mind and a way of being that might be being different in a way that you're not expecting. And yeah, the benefits are pretty amazing. So let's just talk about physically. So physically, that's easy. I mean, choose to do things differently. I don't know, you could choose to, I could choose to cut this down here and uh, sew it up in like a gold thread or crisscrossing silver. I mean, there are so many amazing possibilities where you could just be yourself, you know, physically. That doesn't have to be amazing. You don't have to have blue lips. You could, I don't know, you know, put some glitter on something. You could be, I mean, like whatever, whatever that is. It isn't necessarily being different, but just, you know, celebrating your your spark, your shine, your glisten, gleam, all those amazing things. Choose to be different by feeling great, not just feeling good. So often I still hear, again, I, I like people to be real, but so often, how are you doing? I'm good, I'm okay. It's okay! Okay! No, 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 no. I want you to be amazing, spectacular, magical, inspired, energized. Yes, choose to feel different. If you want to get into it, choose to care and give a damn about how you feel. That is the number one thing, okay? Let's just like get focused on here. When you start and you want to be different, choose to really care about that. People say that they do so often, so often. I hear people say, you know, like, I want to feel good or I do this or, you know, I, do, I am feeling great or, you know, maybe you are. Maybe you're putting yourself out there. Maybe you're not. Either way, you're fine. But, like, really, let's, let's be real. I say that so often. But saying and being different and saying it and doing it, you know, if, your mirror's going to find out if it's, whether it's true or not, okay? So, really, I'm going to ask you to do some homework with me. Okay, I want you to write down the best you could feel for today. What would be, if you could feel something today, how would you love to feel? Doesn't mean you have to feel it all day, but what would you love to feel? Would you love to feel inspired? Would you love to feel energy, you want more energy in life? You wanna feel rich? You wanna feel confident? You wanna feel peaceful? You want to feel angry. I hope not, but I will be honest, sometimes anger can be more helpful than sadness because it can get you to take action, but there's nothing wrong. Do you want to feel sad? I mean, I, uh, maybe you do. Do you want to feel release? Do you want to feel fill in the blank? What do you want to feel today? How often do you want to feel this? Do you want to feel this daily? Uh, let's, let's quantify it. I want you to write it down. Do you want to feel it for a minute? Five minutes, an hour, all day. I mean, start small, okay? So let's just go with a minute, okay? Say you want to feel happy for one minute today. One minute. 
in a minute. Makes you, you would be surprised how many people don't. Like, let's look at the meditation thing. Put it on my hand. Okay, how many years I've gone by and said, oh, I need to meditate more. I've been told to meditate. And, you know, I know it's supposed to have good health benefits and it makes me feel good. Yeah, but yet I'm still not doing it, right? Maybe because you don't enjoy it. <laughs> Could be number one. Or two, because you're just not disciplined enough or there's some belief that you have deep down that, I don't know, that you're not good enough or... You know, who knows what it is? It doesn't really matter what it is. You can look at what that is, fine. But be different, care. Care enough to write down, track for a week. I mean, if you could do it for 21 days, that's even better. But do it for a week, do it for a day. Do it for five days, Monday to Friday. Choose one, okay? Go for longer and write down. I mean, write down for one minute. I wanna feel happy, okay? And feel it. Get yourself to feel it. If you have to listen to that amazing song, you do that. If you've got to do jumping jacks, you got to jump on a trampoline, you do that. If you have to not hurt anybody, do that. Because don't be hurting. Don't be a hater. Don't be hurting. No. You don't want that. So, yeah, don't be doing that. But choose to give a damn about how you really feel on a consistent basis. Consistent. Not just for a day, not just for tomorrow, not just for yesterday, but that is something you would like to have lifelong, okay? Get excited, like really, make it fun. If it's not fun, then it's not funny. <laughs> I've said it before, like, you know, just a laugh, okay? Laugh. You want to have a minute of, I mean, you hear this, they have laughter therapy, laughter meditation, whatever, you want to do that? I support that, okay? But like, come on, you know, I really want to hear from you down below. Tell me, what is it that you want to be feel, well, choose to be different of how you're really going to feel good and be different by telling people how, tell yourself, you don't have to tell, announce it to the world, but it can be helpful. But tell yourself, tell me, tell yourself, what do you want to feel more often? Uh, how often do you want to feel it? What does it look like? And now here's the fun part. It doesn't necessarily have to come from external circumstances. You start to imagine to feel it, and you line up that vibration. I mean, this is not just my idea, okay? It's been talked about many times, but it's you get in the feeling. Are you feeling the feeling? Start feeling the feeling, and you will get ideas of life experiences that you can create, whether that's meeting up with people for a tea party, going to a movie, going to out to dance, going to, I don't know, a new meetup you've never met people before, whatever it is. Watching this video that inspires you, <laughs> you know? But, you know, whatever it is, you will start to attract it and create it. And consciously, if you want to believe in the attraction game, you know, law of attraction kind of stuff, then you're going to uh, consciously focus on that more. Like, what are you focusing on? Are you focusing on the not having that? Or are you focusing on, I want to feel this? So start feeling it. And it's not faking it till you make it. It's the feeling it till you agree with it. Feeling it. Try to think something that runs feeling. Feel it. Feel it. You have to feel yourself up, okay? It's not that kind of channel. Big tip, if you choose to, maybe your thing is you choose to, you want to not give a shit as much about what other people think about you. If it's like scary for you to go out, maybe you're in a small town, people aren't as nice, maybe choose to walk a block. Okay, walk one block wearing a cape or wearing whatever it is that makes you feel whatever. Choose to be ridiculous. Choose to be like, I'm going to wear what I want to wear and I don't care. Okay, so being different, it's not just about how you look, it's about how you think, it's how you feel. Choose to be different of not just saying I'm okay. Okay, like that's not different. That's what everyone else is saying. Oh, I'm good, I'm okay, everything's fine, I'm brilliant, I'm, you know, yeah, I got my house, I got my wife, I got my job, I got my, like, no, 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 no. Start from the inside out, okay? Inside out, choose to be different, you can do it. Thank you so much for joining me. As always, I encourage you to see your star website. Check it out. Seeyourstar.com as well as I make videos twice legally. Something I enjoy doing. I love interacting with you, hearing from you down below. Any ideas, you let me know what that is. And yeah, you know, being different can be fun. It doesn't have to be scary. And I will see you later. Peace. Thank you.